Hello, it's Eric from HWC Automotive. I want to do a video on the Bentleys today. Not a whole lot of videos out there about these cars and what's in them and what you can do with them. So I'll just do a quick overview of the cars. And if anybody has any questions about them, feel free to message me and I can answer the best I can. So far as what I know about the Bentleys, this one is an 05. That was an 07. This is when Audi had more influence in these than Rolls Royce did. I know there was a time period where BMW and Audi were kind of fighting with each other. Who was getting Rolls Royce? Who was getting Bentley? And BMW won on the Rolls Royce end and Audi won on the Bentley end. So this is 05, the first year that was truly a lot of Audi influence. We'll go to the engine here. 6.75 liter. This is a Rolls Royce engine underneath, but it has a lot of Audi components, electronics, the twin turbo. Those are water to air intercoolers. You see it was custom hand built, but it is a lot of Audi, even though it is Rolls Royce. The thing red lines about 4,800 RPMs. It's 412 cubic inches. It makes about, I think around 420, 430 horsepower, but it makes around 650 pound feet of torque at like 1800 RPMs. So this thing is like an old school, big block torque monster. It's cast iron, big stroke. So yeah, this it's a lot of horsepower because, or a lot of torque, excuse me, because this thing weighs almost three tons. So it's a big, heavy car. This is the one that's been sitting for quite a few years. It is a 2005 model, like I said, but only has 690 miles on it. So let's open the back up here. You can see the interior. I doubt the interior or the rear has ever been sat in this thing. It even has the writing tables. Let's see if we can get this come out. Yeah, it has the writing tables. We've got plush floor mats. You can see my hands sinking in it with the footrest. We've got all kinds of seat options back here. You had the mirrors back here. Let's close this. Center console, or little armrest, I should say. There's the Bentley emblem. Even the headliner. The headliner is all leather in this thing. From my understanding, what I learned about these is that it has 12 hides of free-range leather. They, uh, Bentley had their own farm where they raised cattle for the leather in these things, and they were all hand-done. So is all the wood. All the wood in this is hand-done. There's the wheels. It's got the 18-inch wheels. Where the other one, you can see, is a little different color white. It is an 07, and it's got the sport package, and it's got the 19-inch wheels on it. We'll look in the trunk of this one. We just got batteries in this one. Got it running. There's your umbrella. So some of the trunk is apart. There's a carpet piece and everything that goes here. We have it, but it's just out of it for now. And then down here, you had spare light bulbs and gloves and tow hook and wheel chucks. Owner's mail can go right there. And it takes two batteries. One is, a, that's the primary battery. That runs mostly ignition and everything. And then they have what they call the starting battery, which is right there. You can start this car if that battery is completely dead. You turn the ignition on and back off and back on and it re-engages a solenoid in there, activates this battery to a main battery, and you can start it off this battery. So, let's look at the rest of the car here. You know, the carpet and trunk. Just the, the craftsmanship in these cars. All right, let's go out to the front here. There's the interior. Again, that beautiful wood. We'll get in this thing, fire it up. All right. Even the key. You can see the key. Hit the brakes. There she's running. And if I kind of zoom in on right there, you can see 691 miles. I had it outside for a moment. That's why it's saying ice warning. There's all the gauges. You got temperature gauge, clock. You've got engine temperature, fuel, and oil pressure. There's all the climate controls, the shifter. The shifter, like to put it in gear, you got to lift up. There's all your window switches, power mirrors, individual power mirrors. And get in here, there's your power seats, memories, and even heated seat controls. Get up here, there's some more controls up here for the sunroof. There's the mirrors. This is, this is like real metal. This isn't fake plasticky. This is all real metal. And it even has, and I can't believe it still works because the car's been sitting 15 years. There's a button up here. You hit the button and out pops the navigation screen. 
and it still works. Can you believe that? Now there's no buttons or anything on the dash to make it work, so you have to have this remote. I'll show you how it works, but the batteries are dead in the remote, so it doesn't do anything at the moment. We'll have to get batteries for the remote to get that working. And you just hit a button up here, and down she goes and turns off. But probably hard to hear on the camera, but just a big, big old torque monster. So yeah, that is the 2005 Bentley Arnage. So if you got any questions, feel free to message us. We can answer them best we can. But this one actually is running pretty well considering it's been sitting for 15 years. We're gonna get some tires on it, take her for a couple of shakedown runs, make sure everything's okay. And this one's gonna be good to go. So thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and you never know what we're gonna be working on next. Bye.